Hello and welcome to Lot 49. Today we will be looking at polling on what the British public think of the NHS and what they want to see happen to it in the future. So our first poll was conducted back in October 2023 and comes from the National Centre for Social Research. The survey found that satisfaction with the NHS was at an all-time low, with just one in four happy with it as it is. This is a sharp drop from where it was in 2020, when one in two were content with the service. The main reasons given for this dissatisfaction were long waiting times for GP and hospital appointments, staff shortages, and insufficient government spending. Sadly, it is the lack of funding, which I have already talked about on this channel, that has led to the shortage of staff, and it is the shortage of staff that has led to the long waiting times. Anyway, the report highlighted that the public's priorities were making it easier to get GP appointments and properly staffing the NHS once again. As for paying for these improvements, the public said that it should be paid for by raising taxes, an opinion echoed by the Health Foundation study from earlier that year, which found that the public was receptive to a variety of taxations in order to pay for the additional funding. These included an increase in national insurance or an increase in income tax. The Health Foundation study also highlighted the positive feelings the British public has towards the NHS. For many, it is their greatest source of national pride. People like that it is free at the point of use and available to everyone. And the majority think it is crucial to being British and that we must do everything in our power to maintain it. However, despite its integral role in the British mindset, the study also revealed some more worrying results. Half of the population think that in 10 years' time they will have to pay for services that are currently free, and one in four think that they will have to pay at the point of delivery in 10 years' time. While that percentage doesn't represent the majority of the public, it does indicate the level of concern for its future. Anyway, that's it for this video. Thank you for watching. Sources have been left down in the description. So if you want to check out the full articles for yourself, you can find them there. As with all video channels, feel free to like, comment, subscribe and share. And until next time, have a good day.